So the physics kart race is a project where basically you have a um, you have to build a car and drop a one kilogram weight on the car. So you have to use the energy of the weights drop in order to power the car to travel a certain distance. In AP physics, from what I heard, um, you're supposed to go ahead and make it to six meters, whereas regular physics, you're supposed to make it up to four meters. To go that extra two meters, it's all about refining the wheels, making sure that you have the gr greatest ball bearings, make sure that you reduce friction as much as possible. Building the car was definitely a challenge because it's all about making sure all of the variables that could potentially affect the performance of your car they have to be eliminated, you have to consider every single possibility. And plus, uh, the course that the car will race on is an incline, so you have to consider, oh, now gravity is opposing the motion of the car as well. Gluing all the pieces together, at one point I had a car, it cannot stand at all, it just fell apart. What makes this project challenging for students is finding the correct materials to build the car together. There are so many factors and different materials you can use. Honestly, I would go ahead and say it was just the motivation part. Currently, I'm screaming because I'm still trying to find the correct tires. My overall thoughts on the project is that it's an overall good model that incorporates physics while also including a fun factor because at the end of the day, you are creating a project and once you finish it, it's going to be really um, relieving to see how well it does. The car is a challenge to build. Nonetheless, it can be fun when you really put your mind into it. It's stressful when you have like a bunch of other workload too. I think that as you're building the project, you don't feel as if there's an outcome because you're really working to build it as a grade. But after making the project and seeing how well it does, I think that's when this true satisfaction comes. My overall thoughts on this project are, Mr. Bruner, can you please make it easier? <laughs>
No. 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 <laughs> you guys ready for finals this week? No. You go to La Quinta. <laughs> nope. Nope. I'm not at all. You're not worried? You're that good? Uh, when you're a senior, it doesn't matter that much. What? Will we be up all night studying? Yeah. yeah. Are you lying to me? You sound like you're lying to me. <laughs> if you had to say who your worst teacher is, who's your biology teacher? Miss Newman. She's mean, right? No. Because I'm scared. <laughs> is Mr. Alcro scary? Yeah. Uh, my civics teacher is actually my coach, Brian Trent. And he's not a very good teacher, right? I, I like his lectures. I like his lectures a lot. Yeah, what's, your, what's your hardest final going to be? Biology, math, French, English, just all my classes. Just all of them. Chemistry because I always fall asleep in that class. Sorry, Mr. Lai, I'm so sorry. Science and history and English, oh, I'm not ready. It's on Thursday, so I have time. That's tomorrow. All night? Yeah. Good for you. Yeah, get those. Yeah, you got to set it. Let me see. Hi. Did you get him, Bruner? Yeah. I got yes. Him. How'd you guys do? Not good. <laughs> I just had BS. Yeah. And? It was fine.